This is Eva. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to do a localization. Normally, we set up and start based on no point, and we know clear the coordinate system that we are in. Then we only need to set the corresponding coordinate system on software and start to work with rover. But if if we only get several no points but without the exact coordinate system, what should we do? How can we make sure the collected points are under the required coordinate system? In this situation, we can try to convert coordinate system parameters of current system to target one. For example, the target coordinate system is on no, but we got three no points. Firstly, we have to set a current coordinate system for the rover and measure the two no points under the current coordinate system. The third one as a verification point. Secondly, we match coordinates on the current and the target coordinate system. Finally, the software will figure out the parameters converting and apply parameters to finish localization. Well, next I will show you what I'm talking about exactly. In today's demonstration, we will go with G3, H6, and Sir Star. In the very beginning, we created a new project as we do in every project. Since we don't know the target coordinate system, so we gotta set the current coordinate system for the rover. Go ahead to the coordinate system. Ellipsoid, we choose WGS84. Okay. And projection, we select UTM. Okay. Well, well done. Now we are here at the given point number one. Collect it and see. Okay. And then go to the given point number two. Here we go. Collect it and see. And then we go to the tools. Click localization, add. Point name, we input target point 1. And fill the date we already knew. As the given point number 1, north thing is 4630.5. And easting six one eight point two three zero. The hat is twenty one point five eight five. Okay. The geodetical coordinates we can choose from the points database. The point one we collect before. Add and we add the target point two point name TP2. Do the same as target point one. Okay, calculate and apply. Now we go to the coordinate system to check something has changed. You can see the clear, the four parameters and the head fitting parameters. At this step, we have finished the parameters converting. Let's go to the third given point and collect it under the target coordinate system. So in conclusion, this demonstration is only show you a simple case of four parameters conversation. If you encountered more complex situations such as seven parameters in your project, please do not hesitate to contact us. So that's all for today's video. If there is anything else you'd like to know, welcome to leave your comment below. Thank you for watching and see you next time.